All right, Trina, well, looking for something to do this weekend, check out the newest spot to hit the Design District. Sugarcane opened its doors earlier this year, but kept it on the hush-hush. It became such a hot spot, they decided to unveil the restaurant all over again. The man behind Sushi Samba has done it again. Matthew Johnson opened Sugarcane Raw Bar Grill in Midtown, and it's what everyone is talking about. It's like being in the meatpacking district in New York 15 years ago. This is a party for our friends, the people that have supported us in Sushi Samba. Ocean Drive Magazine hosted the chic unveiling, which was filled with cocktails, music by the Spam All-Stars, and lots of yummy foods, sliders, Japanese eggplant, lamb, and some bacon-wrapped appetizers that were delish were just some of the foods making their way around the Latin-inspired room. All creations of executive chef Timon Ballone. We touch uh, the regions of Japan, a little bit of Latin America. We try to reach every country that grows sugarcane. Miami socialite and shoe designer Lisa Pliner was just one of the many indulging. What has been your favorite dish so far? The oysters. <laughs> yeah, I love oysters, but we won't, we're not going to say all that too loud. <laughs> Laura Posada was also seen amongst the crowd. You've probably seen her cheering on her husband, Jorge Posada, catcher for the New York Yankees, but she says she's totally a Miami girl. I live in Miami and I absolutely love it. I wouldn't trade it for the world. I'm having a really good time. Food is really good. The drinks, you know, are, are coming fast, so I'm really enjoying it. Sugarcane has three kitchens, including a raw bar and a good-sized grill where they burn Japanese bincho tan charcoal, giving the food that added touch. It also has an inside and outside bar open late if you want more of a nightlife vibe. It's the new hot spot, but it's going to be hot for a long time, so whenever you get a chance, come on down. And if you'd like to check out Sugarcane this weekend, they are located in Midtown in the Miami Design District. Now for a little flavor, Michael's currently chowing down at two of Miami's freshest eateries. And right next door, another sweet new spot, Sugarcane. Yeah, that's delicious. The newest destination for celebs, like Shakira and the Estefans, has got something for every international palate. We specialize in three kitchens. So we have a Japanese uh, Rabata grill, and then we have a raw bar crudo, where we do things like oysters and sliced fish. And then we have a hot kitchen, where we specialize in tapas and small plates. Like these goat cheese croquettes, a favorite among the Estefans. Miami croquettes, they go hand in hand. And while they love tequila next door, sugar cane has a more tropical feel. We offer 50 different rums. Every rum that's produced from every country in the world that produces sugar cane, we try to have that rum here. So whether it's trying out some tacos or having a date with Shakira, you won't go hungry in Miami. Michael eating. Surprise, surprise. No, I don't get up or anything, Michael. It does look good, though.